This is what's known as a starlight shell and is used for starting uh, fusion reactions in space and stars, basically. And not really for use on the ground, nor for anything else, but I guess somebody found them. Like I said, I probably had, I had them in, ca in cases, basically, encased in, uh, um, uh, what's called lead or whatever, for safety, basically, because they're highly dangerous and highly radio radioactive, and basically, even wearing protective gear, uh, I mean, they're basically just fu they're, they're fusion reactors that haven't actually turned, uh, been activated, basically. Basically, if you want to start a star, like the big one in space right here, you would use that shell. Um, there's called starlight or, or Lucifer starlight shells for a reason. <clears throat> anyway, if you looked at it, it would probably say LSL or something like that. LSL shells, or, or Lucifer, uh, Lucifer star light shells, or LSH, I guess. LSH shells, or no, LSS, LL, uh, S, whatever. <laughs> LS, uh, 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 S, or no, L, anyway, whatever. LSLS, S, or something like that, shells. Anyway, they, they um, they're Lucifer starlight shells, basically. Um, pretty much. Blah, 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 blah. I might as well blabble because um, it doesn't really matter. They killed the Germans that, that, that were guarding them or had them. Never to be used on a planet. No, 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 no. Highly radioactive. Even wearing a suit, they're basically deadly. Um, even a few minutes around them is very bad. Very, very bad. Uh, you know, I would never use one of those shells. Like in like 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 more like a last resort shell if you're going to use it on a planet, but basically it's for space. There, are, um, a lot of Irish would be like, it's for space, not for for use on the ground. Very dangerous. Uh, yeah, if you want to start a star in space, you'd use one of those shells, and basically then you'd wait, and it makes particles. Yee. It takes about a billion years for them to to to, to work though. Or a couple million years. They slowly build in, in matter quantity and all that other stuff. And they would also uh, build in other things. Basically, uh, in space, they have no way to cool or anything like that. So they just keep getting bigger and, bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Until you get a giant fusion ball or they run into something. Uh, I guess for a space weapon, you might you, they might find them useful, I guess. Because there's no way for it to cool down. Basically, they just get bigger and bigger and bigger. And then they start grabbing... Whatever happens to be around. Anyway, it's for making more matter in the universe, basically. Um, and pretty much was pretty much lying in a warehouse and not really being used. Um, basically, these people didn't actually make these shells and didn't know what these shells were, the, other than they found them in the warehouse and probably killed the guards that were actually guarding it. Like I said, like my, uh, my LSF-A um, uh, shuttles, they... Um, you know, that they found in a hangar that were still radioactive. The shells would have been somewhere around in there or something like that. Anyway, apparently somebody found the shells and thought, huh, they must be for a cannon. That's all we need now is a cannon to use them on, use them with. Uh, anyway, for going through armor, yeah, I would do that, but, it would, but, but it's actually for space and not really made for the ground. But So I guess I might as well tell people that, yeah, for creating stars... But I think somebody wanted to go create some suns with them or something like that. Or create some, 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 something, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I use them for creating stars or giant fusion reactors in space. And that's what I use them for. And that's what they do. <clears throat> if you go into an empty space thing and basically shoot one off, you basically get a star. And that's, what, that's why they were Lucifer star light shells. My shells. Anyway, so yeah. So, well, whatever. Some kids broke in, I guess, and found them. Probably this guy. Probably this guy who doesn't know ex what they are, or what they do, and he's related to Bill, Bill Gates, and basically like Bill Gates' dad or Bill Gates' something or other. And basically you become a wanted, hunted man by somebody because they use those shells for a lot of bad things. Anyway, yeah, and uh, yeah, how Bill Gates had, was so powerful or whatever. Anyway, though, uh, basically it kills the, the soldiers that are, that are using them. It kills everyone to the point of target from the from what's called. It kill it kills everyone like like if you're standing right here, it kill kill everyone going to the target. It kills everyone in the target, 
and basically does a lot of radiation stuff, which is really, really bad. They're actually for use in space. Uh, this would be Bill Gates' father or Bill Gates' uncle or something like that, who was part of the whole, like, uh, USAF group or US, USAF group or whatever. And they were broke into a warehouse, found this stuff, and thought, cool, let's use it, man. And then they got a bunch of their friends killed and a bunch of other people killed. Anyway, yeah. Uh, they didn't build it. They didn't know what it was. They didn't know anything about it. They just knew that they could use it. And they read some instructions or whatever and then built a cannon that, would, that, that, that they could actually put it in. And they were ultimate warriors, dude. Alpha male. Alpha Romeo. Anyway, something like that. Something pathetic like that, I think. Um, they're actually for use in space and whatever. Anyway, sorry, I don't want to, I don't mean to sound stupid, but yeah, um, basically they're starlight shells and, um, for use in space. So anyway, yeah, and, uh, these people, that, that guy and his son and some other people broke into a warehouse, killed some people, and found them. But didn't know how to use them, or whatever else. Anyway, just like the FL, I mean the LSF-A, uh, 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 shuttle, you know, I mean, anyway, though. So anyway, so that's what's going on with them. Their fusion reactors are not safe at all. And basically, to even be around them, you'd need a suit, pretty much. And and basically, if you fire it into space, you can actually get a star. And that's why it was called a starlight shell or a fusion reaction in space. And stuff like that. So just so you know what they are, yeah, they're not really cannon shell rounds. They will go through armor armor and all kinds of stuff and maybe even sink a boat if you if you actually hit one with it um they're very dangerous i mean but uh i wouldn't suggest using them <laughs> uh yeah because they're highly radioactive and highly dangerous it's not depleted uranium at all it's uranium rods that's what they are anyway bill gates would probably like to cover all that up and a lot of other people would probably cover up like to cover up what they were using and where they found it and whose stuff they found but it was mine and it was called a um, starlight shell. Lucifer starlight shell. They thought it was a light something and something shell, but no, it's Lucifer starlight shell. Anyway, so yeah. Anyway, that's what they were. And this guy is not a genius. Nor is his son. Nor is anyone around them. Nor do they know how to do anything other than shoot some people and break into a warehouse and then open up something which basically irradiated them or the other people they were with. So anyway. Yeah, you know, hey, I'm 800, I'm quite, a, quite, a, quite galactic. Maybe they bought the warehouse, I don't know, or they couldn't have bought it though. Yeah, whatever, very strange. Very, very strange people. Anyway, though, they killed a lot of people, and it raided half a desert or something like that. I don't know. Stupid. They're for space, dude. They're for outer space. If you want to create a, uh, a star in space, that's what you'd use. And they're not really for on a planet. They were in a, in a museum for a reason. <laughs>